for the longest time, we have known the face on Mars' name is Alalu. First Anunnaki king that was deposed by the current Anu. I can't remember his name, but he is the father of Inki and Enlil. Alalu here bit off homeboy's penis and uh, got deserted to Mars. So, and that's not my story. That's just the freaking way it goes. And uh, he may have memorialized him in the statue. On, and that's in Bible canon. I Now reading this, you would believe that, you know, the moon shouldn't be doing cartwheels. However, when you go down here, they start talking about in the 90s it shifted. Well, why in 2000 were they lying to us? But here, April 28th, they want, uh, uh, last year, 2021, they want you to believe that it has shifted since the 90s all of a sudden, and they're telling you melting glaciers caused this. <clears throat> But now, I mean, everybody's talking about, um, you know, spun sideways on its axis. What if? Um, that was in 2019, but 2021, they're talking about, oh, it's literally shifting Earth's axis. That's because everybody has noticed that the damn moon is doing a cartwheel. Except for Lee, of course, who just this moment reposted a lie. Your moon does roll 180 degrees. The man lays on his back with little cardboard signs uh, with the moon literally still doing 180 degrees. But if you lay on your back and look at it, it's the proper way. <clears throat> Said no sailor ever. But this guy that claims to be an HBAC engineer is laying tile holding the dumb end of a tape measure, being drunk, laying on his back, choking on vomit, trying to feed you antifreeze. It's, it's fucking amazing. I can't. So today, we tilt at 23.5 degrees. But what would happen if we tilted even more? What if Earth spun sideways on its axis? Well, it wouldn't take long before utter chaos ensued. Warming, Jupiter, Mars, Pluto, Neptune, Earth. I don't know. Seems like it's a lot bigger than cow farts. Space cows. So they start talking about the polar vortex as a clockwise manner rotation on the planet Earth. That began in 2010. And Coriolis effect says that shouldn't happen. And that's just simple physics and never has before but over the last 12 years boy howdy has it overridden our planet because it kept getting closer and stronger every year mr weatherman was trying to tell you <clears throat> nobody was listening sorry mr weatherman i know how it feels as you can see three levels down now we have a uh, hmm, abnormal atmosphere <laughs> and it translates all the way to the surface with the same rotations been sitting here we've been covering in several previous videos including the new hurricanes that develop over here this one that's been beating the crap out of iceland and greenland for three months and uh this over here in uh the UK and all that, flying trees. And speaking of trees, they're all on fire. <clears throat> I've told why this is going to happen long before it began. Yeah, it was written down in them books uh, that you call script because uh, the Crown Vatican DC Corporation has seen this before, just like the Hopi and everybody else. We already covered that in previous videos. Crown Vatican DC Corporation owns this whole globe 180 nations get their money printed from them and all your books are printed by them you know it's not a coincidence we've gone over this extensively 
I gave the physics of why this would start this year and has continued to worsen. Uh, why Orion is laying in his on his back all summer long. He's the winter hunter. He should be on the other side of the sun, but he's not. In fact, at about one o'clock in the morning, you can see the son bitch laying down on the job on the eastern horizon ish. See, it talks as if Orion is only visible and he's always standing up because he's the hunter in certain months because he's on the other side of the sun in the summer. <clears throat> Why is Orion only visible in the winter? Because he's on the other side of the sun. Do you see Orion on the horizon, depicted on the horizon all the time, on the horizon, on the horizon, he's standing up? Tonight, when you look at him, he'll be laying down on his back. When you see him set, he'll be laying on his face. That's not something the hunter used to do. In 2010, that polar vortex tilted us, and it got stronger every year because that magnet that tilted us got closer. And we've covered the three suns, and if you can't deal with it, you just can't deal with it. That's okay. You'll find out yourself soon enough. I'm not here to convince anybody. I'm telling you it's time to open your eyes and start looking the fuck around. And that's about all I got for you. But this is why everything in your sky changed. How can Polaris be in the right position when the Big Dipper is setting in the west by 3 o'clock in the morning? 